Hello everyone. Welcome to my channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before starting the video, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a like up. Honey Boo Boo has been butting heads with Mama June over college funds in the new season 7. The latter has been trying hard to move to Colorado for her studies. However, June Shannon's behavior and direct refusal have been getting on her nerves. She and Pumpkin are unable to understand the real reason for their mother being so against Alana's college decision. Recently, the siblings decided to ask their mother for some money for the college fees. Things went downhill when Shannon revealed that she had already spent all the money on her past drug addiction. But it turns out that Alana wasn't ready to buy her mother's excuses. She also accused her of spending money on her husband's jewelry instead of her college fees. Mama June slammed for prioritizing husband's jewelry more than Honey Boo Boo's college funds. Mama June has been making sure to give her daughter some tough love in the latest season. She has been making headlines for refusing Alana any kind of help with her college fees. The recent episode revealed Alana admitting she would like her mother's help, but she felt that her mother didn't believe her. Meanwhile, June has made it clear that she wouldn't sugarcoat and lie about helping her with the money. She asked Honey Boo Boo to reconsider if she actually wanted to go to college. She had made it clear that she had been rebuilding her life after losing all her money in her past drug addiction. The reality TV celeb stated that she won't be able to pay even half of the money. But Pumpkin intervened and shared that her sister only wanted help in her first semester. Alana went ahead to ask her mom about the Kukin account. However, Mama June revealed that her youngest daughter can't use the money until she turns 21. Still, she vowed to contact the bank and find a solution. Alana and Pumpkin left their mom's house with several suspicions. The former felt that her mothers didn't want her to leave for college. Meanwhile, Lauren accused Shannon of avoiding all kinds of motherly responsibilities. Alana was deeply disappointed with her mother's reaction. She expressed, maybe she thinks that paying for Justin's chains or something is more important than giving it to me for college. Mama June admits lying to Alana about her Cuban account. Mama June has been trying hard to rebuild her reputation by being present for her daughters in the new season. However, her latest revelation ruined all her hard work. June had a discussion with her husband after her daughters left the house. She opened up about not helping Alana and called it tough love. She then revealed that she was lying about Alana's Kudin account. The reality TV star stated, I've lied to them and told them that you can't get your money until you're 21, so they wouldn't blow through it. Fans were shocked by the big confession and slammed the celebrity for her lies. In the bustling realm of reality television, few names have captured the attention of audiences quite like the Thompson family, better known as the stars of Here Comes Honey Boo Boo. From their humble beginnings in McIntyre, Georgia, to their rise to fame, the Thompsons have lived their lives under the scrutiny of the public eye. But amidst the glitz, glamour, and gallons of go-go juice, a storm was brewing, one that would rock the family to its core. At the center of this tempest stood Alana Thompson, affectionately known as Honey Boo Boo. With her infectious personality and undeniable charm, Alana quickly became the breakout star of the show. But behind the scenes, away from the cameras and the chaos, a rift was forming between mother and daughter, a divide born out of love, but fueled by resentment. It all began with a simple dream, a dream shared by many young Americans the dream of a college education. For Alana, this dream burned bright, a beacon of hope in a world filled with uncertainty. But as she would soon discover, dreams often come with a price tag, one that Mama June, her mother and manager, seemed increasingly unwilling to pay. The first whispers of discontent arose during a routine family dinner. The clanking of utensils drowned out by the weight of unspoken tension. It was Alana who dared to break the silence, her voice trembling with a mixture of fear and frustration. Mama, she began, her gaze fixed on her plate. I've been thinking about college. Mama June, ever the matriarch, glanced up from her meal, a forced smile plastered across her lips. College, huh? That's mighty ambitious of you, pumpkin.
But behind the facade of maternal encouragement, Alana sensed something else. An undercurrent of doubt, perhaps, or even indifference. It was a feeling she couldn't shake, no matter how hard she tried. As the weeks turned into months, Alana's resolve only grew stronger. She devoured college brochures like they were the latest gossip magazine, each page a window into a world beyond the confines of McIntyre. But with each passing day, Mama June seemed more preoccupied, more distant, a ghost of the mother Alana once knew. And then, one fateful evening, everything came to a head. The cameras were rolling, as they always were, capturing every moment for the world to see. But this time, there was no script, no rehearsed lines, only raw emotion, simmering beneath the surface like a pot ready to boil over. It started innocently enough, a conversation about finances, about the future. But as the minutes ticked by, the tension in the room became palpable, a living, breathing entity that threatened to consume them all. I just don't understand, Mama, Alana exclaimed, her voice tinged with desperation. Why won't you help me pay for college? Don't you want me to have a better life? Mama June's response was swift, a sharp retort that cut through the air like a knife. Of course I want what's best for you, sugar bear. But we've got bills to pay, mouths to feed. I can't just wave a magic wand and make all our problems disappear. But for Alana, the explanation fell flat. A hollow excuse that failed to mask the truth lurking beneath the surface. And as the tears welled in her eyes, she knew what she had to do. With a trembling hand, she reached for her phone, fingers flying across the screen in a blur of determination. And then in one swift motion, she hit send. A message to the world, a cry for help, a plea for understanding. The response was immediate, overwhelming. A tidal wave of support crashing against the shores of her fractured reality. Messages poured in from fans and followers alike, their words a lifeline in her darkest hour. And in that moment, Alana knew she wasn't alone, not anymore. But amidst the chaos, amidst the cacophony of voices clamoring for attention, one question remained unanswered. What would become of the Thompson family, of Honey Boo Boo and Mama June? Only time would tell. A precious commodity in a world where dreams hung in the balance, where love and loss danced a delicate dance on the razor's edge of reality.